Hello, hello to all amazing people, the Neymar here and welcome to another episode of Dead in Winland. Also welcome to the channel, I play a long series of games I really enjoy, so find your favorite playlist, watch it, enjoy it, maybe even like and subscribe. As for this game, it is a Viking themed party management crafting survival exploration game, I'm enjoying it a lot, I'm on day 80 right now. If you want to watch it from the start, there's a playlist in the comment and description below the video. So yeah, let's get started. So last time I explored a little bit, I dealt with the gate, got a double case of power. I don't know, yeah, and well, I'm gonna lay off the events for a little bit until I can recover my potions. I mean, I only really have like what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven events available right now, anyway. So I did most of them. So this episode, no events until I can recover my potion supply. That's how I decided to do it. Let's check out the garden here. Okay, it's ready to be harvested. I mean, I like sending blood of it, so she levels up her gardening. Um, she gets bonus experience from it, so that's how we're gonna do it. Uh, Kari is gonna be on water duty, that's fine. I think I lost my battle dog thing, so we need to redo that, so we're gonna be doing that. Uh, guard dog, battle dog, there we go. For now, I'm not gonna pick up guard dog. But uh, in the future, I just might. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, okay, on the dryer. Okay, we got some plenty of food here. I'm gonna start some more. And yeah, let's dry up some more fish. And let's also repair those stations, shall we? Okay, let's see what we're working on here. Nothing right now. So I guess I made a whole bunch of ropes or something. Okay. Who's gonna help Eric with fishing? I mean, usually... Usually that would be Kari, but while Rain is not falling, I really need her here. I guess I could increase the number of people that could go and fetch water. That might be smart, actually. Because uh, I'm struggling a little bit with it. Maximum non-potable water stock enables activity for two people. Bam, let's do this one. And let's have her do some more ointments and stuff. I don't know. Uh, healing. I don't know, let's do this one, I guess. There. Who's gonna help him with fishing? Oh, she's not really good at it. How about you? Well, the maximum amount gets increased by quite a lot, so I guess that's all right. Okay, he's doing the... he's handling the sheep. Hopefully, okay, they're all nice and healthy now. Are they still young? They're still young sheep. Okay. Okay, you can turn milk into cheese. I guess that's a good idea. I am just gonna have him here work it out. Somebody can rest. Okay. How good are you? 4 to 19. Actually, no. You go there, you take a break. There you go. I think that's gonna be it. Uh, let's check people real fast just to make sure nobody has any wounds and stuff. Hunger strike. Very dangerous. Diarrhea. Goes away in one day. Rash. Uh, okay, we need to get rid of that. Let's wait for the diarrhea to go away. And then I'll remove the rash. Okay. Right. Fatigue. Okay, get nice, nice rest. Again, I forgot to give. See, <laughs> say his vet stone. Yeah, I don't know. Uh. Okay, there was no fight, so that's good, I guess. There we go. Okay. Uh, right, so that looks good. Get some more water. Yeah, we need plenty of water. Okay, the doggy did his thing. Okay, we're gonna get the bones now, because I want to get this one as soon as I can. So, three bones needed for that. Okay, she's done with her job there, so she's gonna go and cook. I'm gonna go up to 96 here. Okay, I'm gonna dry up some food. Okay, that looks good. 
4, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, How's the thing? Oh yeah, she, we can level her up. It's been a while since we leveled her up. Heart Hitter, Call of the Mighty, Apprentice Explorer, Call of the Forest or Experienced Cook. Uh, strength minus five and Constitution. What is Constitution used for? Shipwreck, Harvesting Camp, Garden Pants. Mm, I think she actually needs strength. Yeah, for Mining Camp. I don't know these traits. What's our nightmares? Okay. Forestry. I don't want to lose mining skill. That doesn't seem like a good idea. Let's reroll, see what else we can get. Limping Swordmaster. Okay. Constitution plus 10. Beast Handling plus 10. You know what? Let's just get some pure stats here. There we go. That's good. I want people to be like really high on stats so we more easily do the events when the time comes. Although we do have plenty of these items which increase stats and we'll get even some more from the doggy. So that's that. Hunting plus five. I think we just give this to Kari. Ulur's Golden Arrow, son of Sif, god of hunting in winter, known for being the first sufferer, he used to glide to water with, that, with his shield. Son of Sif, Ulur, the son of Sif. They had many penguins together. It seems like a good idea. I might, I'll do it just before uh, the time comes for that. Let me see something here. The mining camp's in a good shape, so I should definitely mine here. Now. Not sure if she should do it alone. I mean, usually Kari helps her out, right? Problem with that is that I kind of need water, so. Okay, she's good enough. Although, I kind of want some herbs. And that's what she's best for. Okay, we got seeds, so that's good. We can, uh, we can. Oh, we need to plow, but we also need to cook. Mm. I don't know. You can plow then. We didn't grab anything today, really. Twenty-two, forty-eight, forty-seven. I mean, I'm okay with herbs, but nah, that's really not acceptable. Let's grab some healing plants. What if we don't cook tonight? We have so many food to cook though. I guess I could just have somebody else plow, although it's not ideal. I can finish that though. I can still grab some stones or iron even though if she's working alone. Seems such a waste though. Could also do some wood cutting. I could really use some rain, to be honest. Alright. I don't care. Just just play it. Okay, now we can gather water with two people. Oh, ten! Ten bones, that's really good. Okay. And bam, we get the fight. No problem, no worry, no foul. We should be able to easily do it here. Okay, I think I'll actually go for the knife guy here. Uh, he does have damage resistance, so... He also has damage resistance. So I'm not sure, who has the least effect resistance? One of these two? Uh, he's going first, which is not ideal, 2-2 damage, yeah. Do that. All enemies in any row reduce their AP by one. No, I think I just go for this one. Even though it's like low damage. There. Ok, 
Okay, do we leave him here? Sure. Okay, then this dude could be next, I guess. Okay, actually, you know what? How many is this? This is five. We cannot do it. I can do this, though. One to four. Yeah. Let's move her to back. There we go. And then you... Make yourself a little bit stronger. In there. Guard him. And let's move back. There we go. Drinks on you. Yeah, you're annoying, dude. But it is what it is. Okay. Uh, I guess we go for him now. Debuff. Nice. Yeah, that's a good damage. Nice. Okay. Okay. Easy peasy. Let me squeeze you. Five damage. Oh, that's wonderful. That's just wonderful. And yeah, we're going get done here. Just gonna put Blood Red in front. So one of the easier fights. I didn't need the Vat Stone in the end. Lucky me. Lucky me indeed. Ha! Ha! You're critting. You're critting a lot. What are you gonna do? Go clubbing? Yeah, well, I guess you will. That's a lot of damage. It really is. 3 to 3? That's good enough. He has so much AP. Now I know I didn't build my warriors the best, but uh, it's good enough for now. And hopefully with like some buffs, armor and whetstones and stuff, I can like make up for the fact that my warriors are not top notch. Uh, okay, so we're going to do this. I also gonna need to get some water. I'm actually doing pretty well with water, I just realized. All right. Got a new location. What is it? Oh, it's a reflections in the water kind of thing. Oh, I wonder if we can get something good there. Like a rune. But uh, like I said, I'm not going to be fooling around with that for now. Uh, right, so we can take this. The energy cost of every action is reduced by 10%. That's pretty nice. Uh, we will need two meat to do it. We can also do it tomorrow. Right, I think we are done with the day today. Come on, CC, please stop your hunger strike already. <laughs> You're gonna die, dude. CC, as, as your healer, I'll ask you one last time eat now. Well, maybe you should ask him as uh, his future to be lover. Maybe that would work, Moira. Drop your guard, have some beautiful love, and everything will be fine. My dear Moira, you know that I can't. I mean, imagine if, like, he was actually pretty hungry when this happened, like, he was basically fully fed. So, I imagine this should be resolved soon. If this doesn't help Moira, then I don't know what will. Ah, do it for me! Convince him. Everyone cares for you. Too bad for him. Do it for Moira, do it. Hidden conditions met. Three hidden conditions met. Everyone cares for you. So I guess this one is because she loves him. And this one is because like Kari, uh, Eric and uh, Vlodovet like him and Moira. Well, three out of four of those. But do it for her. I want to see a love story here. Do it for me, Sisei. What would I ever do without you? Sisei, please. I'm worried to that. Should you die, I, I, I don't know what I would do. <laughs> Go on a hunger strike, obviously. <laughs> nice. There we go. Uh, if you want to go quickly, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. You remember? Uh, throwing his own words back at him. Nice. Uh, yes. My heart is sad to have failed, but it's filled with love. Thank you, Moira. Oh, you have failed? Oh, does that mean you failed with your hunger strike? Please. Good friends. No! Removed? Yes! Yes! Good friends? Um, 
Did he just get friend zoned? No way, dude. Cissé and Maria find themselves alone around the campfire. While Cissé is playing some notes on his weird instrument, Maria rests her head on his leg. Well, that, that's not what friends do. <laughs> Somebody give a memo to the, to, to the makers of this game. That's not usually how it goes when you get friend zoned. It might. I don't know. I wouldn't have any experience with that, would I? No, no, definitely not. Anyhow, uh, I could listen to your music forever. <laughs> yeah, it just keeps giving the heart. It's like, it's like must be over the top for a while now. I shall play forever then. Uh, what do you think there is after that? Hmm. In my homeland, we believe that your body and your spirit melt with earth, air and water. But here? I don't know. Only a fool would say he knows such things. And ghosts! <laughs> what ghosts? <laughs> Aha, yes. Why are you thinking about that, Moira? I, uh, I'm afraid. Well, she was never afraid before because, well, she didn't know love. And now that she knows love, she's afraid of loss and she's afraid of that. Ah, the beautiful and not so beautiful things in life. I'm afraid to just disappear and leave no trace here. I guess that's why people make babies. I never thought of it before being so close to that. Oh yeah, make some babies. We have a, Do we have a free slot in the camp? And I fear that now it's too late. Why do you say that? You can always leave a trace. You left a trace on everyone you interacted with. Me, your family, even our enemies. They will carry your legacy way beyond your death. I am. Uh... And uh, you still can find a husband and bear a child. But uh, will I be able to carry a child? Maybe that's something your body forgets how to do if you close your mind to it for too much time. And uh, what if uh, I'm a bad mom? What if... My son becomes a new Bjorn because I rescued him badly. Well, just have a girl then. Problem solved. Depressed. Oh, don't be depressed. I, uh... As we say, when you follow in the path of your father, you learn to walk like him. I'm sure everything will be fine. Uh... <laughs> Too much booze, I'm drunk. You promise? It's a promise? Yeah. It's a lie, but it's a heartwarming one. Thank you, Sise. Okay, cool. Alright. That's good. Um, I forgot to plant the crops. I knew I forgot something. Damn it. <laughs> oh well, we'll just plant it tomorrow. It's not a big deal. But yeah, hunger strike is done. We can celebrate. There you go. The best fish goes to you, Sise. And finally he eats. Isn't that just wonderful? Just beautiful, beautiful. All right. So what's going to be the next challenge? Okay. Well, we got some crappy meals for some more. Uh, nourishments and stuff. Oh, it's raining. That's really good. It's storming. That's not that great, but it's all right. Oh, poor fishies. Uh, yeah, this food is not meant to be. It will rot and stuff. I mean, I was thinking to like make these a little bit. There we go. 50% chance of resisting food spoiling due to rainy weather. Let's do that. Also, I feel like I, I might need more ropes. There. Uh, who's gonna work on it though? I have no idea. Okay, we don't need to do... Okay, Blood of It can work on it. Uh, we should plant the crops. Vegetables, wheat, hemp. Let's do hemp. There we go. And... Uh, okay, gathering some healing plants. Plants. Oh, we got plenty of milk. I guess one of the goats got milk. That's pretty good. Love it. Um, okay, let's give them some food. So their health goes up a little bit. It's raining, so let's make plenty of food now for them. There we go. 
Okay, let's go grab some stones and stuff. There we go. Yeah, stones look it. She's in her station, that's wonderful. You know what? Let's uh, start using this. For 48 days. Oh, for 7 days, that's really good. I love it. I'm loving it. Okay, now we're gonna need some more hemp, probably. There we go. For some more ropes and stuff. Uh, Eric. Yeah, you go fishing. Okay, blood event's there. She's gonna cook in the evening. I mean... We probably don't need to beast handle. Help you fish, please. There we go. Oh, we can also rest him. He's not in the bestest of shapes. Yeah, let's do that instead. I mean, he's most probably gonna gather enough fish so we can cook something tonight again. That's pretty good. Oh yeah, the doggy. We need to train him. So we're gonna need two meat for that. There we go. Hey, Valur. Why can't I do this? Ah, okay. Bam! Okay, Mr. GLC, can you calculate for me, like... If I had this, instead of this, how many points would I save? 10%? What were the actions I did in the meantime? I think I only did two actions. I did guards and fetch, right? So how many energy did I save? And I did two rests. How many did I get with this? So in the end, was it better to take this one first or this one? I think it was about the same to tell you the truth. So anyhow, let's rest now the doggy. Uh... Yeah, he's gonna need a good rest, but then he's gonna need to start fetching items like crazy. It's gonna be legendary. Okay, let's see. Uh, you're resting. That's all right. Uh, you're making rain protection for the for the dried food because well now we are doing dried food three bits apparently. Okay, blood of it's working on some ropes. That's all right. Um, yeah, it all seems good. We have plenty of stuff. You know what? Maybe I do iron instead for a little bit. I don't know. In any case, everything seems just great. Okay, we got some nice fish. Wonderful. Fighting time! Well, now she says it's gonna hit like a truck. Looking forward to that. Uh, right, right, right. Okay, this should be simple enough. We're gonna do that. Resist it. Oh no, let's try again. Okay, I'm gonna move her back. No, okay, she say six to six. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. Uh, okay, I need to protect her. And then, nice guy. Of course, that was like three different things. First of all, he didn't have damage resistance. Second of all, she gave him the damage uh, increase. And then, third of all, he has the, the sharp tools. So, yeah. Lots of things came together for him to be just amazing. So that's pretty good. Tactical retreat. Well, you can retreat all you like, but there's no, no, no running away from me. Okay, we guessed it that it's gonna go there, so that's pretty good. Okay, this one's really annoying, so let's do him first. Ha! Huh. Well, we just have just enough. What is the accuracy of this thing? It says 100%, so hopefully that's correct. Huh! <laughs> No, nothing else to attack but her, and she's pretty tanky, so that's good. And yeah, that's it. Another one buys the dust. Down, down, down. Another one buys the dust. Bam. Wonderful. 
Oh, some dried fruits that might be useful. Oh, some crappy meals. Wonderful. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna move blood of it to cooking now. There we go. Not make salt, I said cooking. I'm gonna cook a whole bunch of fish here. Let's go to 96, why not, right? Well, actually, let's have some tomatoes. Let's make all the tomatoes, I guess. And then, well, actually, we could make these meals. You know what? Let's just make the best meals possible here. Five, okay. There you go, 96. I should use a bah. Okay. Okay. Need to increase this thing. 98, that's good. Okay, she goes there, then that means Eric now goes here. Now he is a little bit depressed. So maybe he should have some R and R. Yeah, sure. We have plenty of beer, so I'll just have some beers here. Oh yeah, it's raining, so I definitely can prepare some more potions. There we go. Prepare some stations. Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, cooking pot got hit hard. So tomorrow we'll probably gather some stones. Oh, the wood is below 100. Okay. That's a little bit scary. But yeah, let's make the protection thing. Ah, hopefully he can do it. Ah, maybe not. We'll see, we'll see. I don't not to worry. But anyway, uh, he can do something useful. You can tend to the sheep so they get nice and healthy, I guess. Not sure how important it is. It might be pretty important. All right. Okay, just tend to the sheep. That's your job, dude. That's your job. Okay, Kari. Um, well, she can grab even more water. She can also... Just go and craft something, though. I'm gonna go and gonna craft, like, one more of these, I guess. There we go. Grab some berries, maybe. Yeah, it looks good. Berries are good, so we can put them to drying, even though, like, right now it's probably not a smart idea, but we're kind of running out, so. A little bit low on food here, also. But, like, I need to. Yeah, these need to rest. We're getting a little bit sick. We're gonna need to solve that as well. Oh, yeah, looks good, more or less. There's just so much to do. Like, I think. I don't know, every time we need to tend to the garden, it's like... <laughs> I feel like garden is just not needed. Yeah. Sadly, I, that's how I feel, that the garden is just not needed. Anyway. Oh, dude. Much disappointed, dude. Oh, it seems like the, the storm hit that thing again. It seems like it did. Okay. Right. Uh, poof. Oh yeah, we're in the front row, so we can just go and do that. Health plus one, dodge, ninety percent. And this one, ninety percent. This one also has dodge. Yeah. Okay. Hopefully they don't dodge. Ah. Now this one became even better than this one, right? Because of the whole plus one damage thing becomes way more efficient. Okay, um... Uh, one to four. Yeah, no. It's a little bit crappy, but okay. <laughs> Two crit, okay. Okay, I'm gonna move her in front. Protect her from the slaver and uh, hit him. I mean, I will s use Shano for dodge in the future again, but once I get the other buff from the doggy. Right now, I'm just. Uh... Well, that was nasty. I think you're next then. 
It's time for revenge. I think at this point, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna try to get as many items as I can with the doggy to max out people's stats before I jump back onto the events. Yeah, I think that's the plan. Now I could kill this thing, but then I remain in front. Um, if I'm, I might also miss. One to three. There. I mean, that wasn't really that important, though. The thing is, th this dude can't really attack anything here, and that dude would go last anyway, so Blood of it would be able to finish him off, so... No worry, no foul there. Plus, if somebody does get wounded, it's not the end of the... the, the world. We can easily fix it. We have, like, a million bandages and stuff, so... It's really, really easy. Okay, whatever. Okay. Pop, pop. No, I'm really low on ropes, but we are making some more, right? I think so. Okay. How's the doggy doing? Eh, going up. Going up in the world. There we go. Repair the stuff. Yeah, we're gonna need some. I was like, I want some rain, and now that I got that rain, I'm like, I don't want no rain, that was really bad. Like, I'm not happy. <laughs> I always complain, <laughs> no matter what happens. Okay, let's check out people's stat traits here. Depressed. Okay. Nightmares for two more days, okay. Oh, there we go. Smelly. Charisma minus 10. I guess that's because of the sheep. Okay, he has fever for four days and some rash. Oh, he got fever from the rash. 10% chance to generate headache each night. 70% chance to be healed. AP minus 1 in battle. And... Dude, I'm sorry. Just gonna have to tough it out. I'm really not gonna... I'm gonna remove the rash, I guess. But not while there's something else active. So hopefully Fever can run out and then re remove the rash. Otherwise he just has to endure it. Yeah. Brother Angelico, now it's time to show you how strong your faith is. <laughs> I'm such an evil person, dude. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna start... Okay, well actually, we have like a gazillion of water, I just realized. I need more medicinal plants. Okay, you know what, dude? Where are you, brother Angelico? I I decided to show you mercy. There you go. Good. Uh, and yeah, I guess that's gonna be it here. Anything else? No, I don't think I forgot anything now. Can't plant. We can butcher these for meat if we need to. It'll be... I wonder when they get older. They're still young sheep, so they don't want to breed yet. That's okay. Uh, cool. Uh, let's... Uh, end the day here. Now they're all going to get really tired. Because of the storms. So attacked by a drakkar, huh? Mm. The terrible pirate forced to his knees before the Norseman's might. Uh, when you take the path of violence, you know that you'll meet someone stronger than you. The only question is when? Guess you didn't fully trust us either when we met you, given that Norsemen were the cause of your fall. Ah, she's lying, Moira. You could say that. Um, I don't trust anyone either way. That's the lesson life has taught me many times. Poor boy. A woman, perhaps? Ah! <laughs> when you know women like I do, you trust them because you know how their little hats work. It's men who are treacherous. I wouldn't trust even my own self. I wouldn't either, Eustachie. I wouldn't either. I know men, too. I'd say they're quite simple to understand once you see them naked. <laughs> how many have you had? 
Mm, enough is so that people in village called me a witch. Oh, dude. Why are you talking with him? He's just making you depressed. A man can sleep with as many women as he wants. He'll be called a hero. But a woman has only two choices. Being a child, then being a wife. And when you don't want to be a wife and you surely aren't a child anymore, they call it the devil's work. People don't like to be reminded that they live in cages. Free minds like us scare the shit out of them. The good thing is here no one's judging us. Uh, Moira, what are you doing? Eustashi? That's really poor taste. Really, really, really poor taste. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. Okay, water for everyone, not like it's pouring outside. And then, let's see. Ooh. Tasty cooked meal. Mm. 30, 20 to 30 hunger and also reduces depression. Uh, that's some good food if I ever saw any. Who's depressed? Blood of it a little bit. There you go, blood of it. And then this thing. Also reduces depression. That's kind of cool. Who's depressed? Kari? There you go, Kari. Ah, yes, Tashi. All right. All right. Okay, you can get that, you can get that, you can get that, you can get that, you can get that. Anyone else hungry? Okay, we also got some berries. Kind of important to keep everyone nice and fat. You never know who's gonna be the next one going onto a hunger strike. Probably no one, but hey, you never know with these things. Okay. Oh yeah, she's having nightmares. Okay. Rainy. Now rainy is good. I like rainy. Rainy is pretty good. Alright, so I'm gonna be able to make some more potions. So then maybe, yeah, then maybe I can encourage myself to do some more of the events in the next episode. So, yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed this one though. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. I wish you all to have a wonderful day, do some nice things, uh, be kind to each other. Oh, why is this one at 9, 9, 10 to 14? Oh, it's an adult ship. Hello. Do some nice things, be kind to each other, and let's make the world a better place together. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you in the next episode of That in Vinland. The Niemer signing out. Bye-bye.